everybody welcome back to Miriam Cast channel in this video we are still in Mumbai and we are exploring more things in Mumbai but today we are just outside the world's biggest open laundry and it happens to be in Mumbai which is super cool so the biggest open laundry is just literally behind me and it's called the Gobi Dab and this laundry is actually 140 years old so quite a long time yeah from what I can see from this view over here is that everything is washed by hand and dried also it's like put on these lines and it makes rows of clothing together and it looks super cool so I was quite curious why this is happening and I found out that all the laundry downstairs is from places like hotels hospitals garment makers just basically people like that and we are on this viewpoint here and this is what we can see from the top view and we can already see like these sort of squares and there are people washing clothes in there smacking them on the concrete putting them in water putting them in liquid and washing them and as you can see there are rows of clothing being dried over here over there and loads of jeans and t-shirts on this side as well but actually it goes all the way i don't know how far this goes but it looks like quite a big area and from down the bottom here we can see so many trucks actually waiting for the clothes and also opposite this big laundry place you have a lot of shops a lot of snack shops and clothes shops and here we are this is the entry to the laundry so this area here is for jeans as you can see there's just so many jeans here and you have this man over here in action washing the jeans so he's got like this square sort of bathtub with the stone in the middle and what he does he just as you can see tosses the clothing around in the water and then puts it on the stone and if he has to take any scraps out he grabs the brush just behind him and scrubs the clothes as well So this is where all the ironing takes place as you can see there are sections here and these men bring those clothes in giant bags that they have tied it up it's a really flat iron actually i've never seen such an iron before have you seen such an iron before it's a really flat iron and a lot of people actually live in this area as well among all these alleyways you have houses And that is the tour of the biggest open laundry in Mumbai here completed. We have actually been stopped a few times, been told that we have to pay to enter this place, which is like not true. Then we were told we're only allowed to come here with a guide, which again is like not true because there's no actual entry and exit. And we were also told that we're not allowed to record anything, which I managed to record some footage for you here because I think it's just like a very good experience I would really recommend anybody if you're ever visiting Mumbai to visit one of those places you can walk literally around the whole area where they wash clothes <laughs> we have some friends down here <laughs> it's literally just a neighborhood that any any other neighborhood that you can just walk through there's no booking entrance or nothing like that you just walk through like it's a street people live there they have their own little like kind of like community there we have been quite popular in the area because of Arella and everybody's been really nice been saying hello the kids have been saying hello which is really nice and yeah I'll just say 
it's a cool experience and literally don't trust anybody if you've been told you have to pay some sort of money or this and that just do your own thing be polite try not to be in the way because it's quite busy and then people are walking around really fast trying to work so the most important thing for you is obviously not to get in the way and be an obstacle but yeah this is it for the video i hope you guys enjoyed if you did then don't forget to give a big thumbs up and if you are from mumbai and if you know any information about this open laundry and you know whether we actually have to pay or no let me know down in comments below i would love to know actual truth whether you have to pay all i know is that internet just doesn't tell you you have to pay or anything it's just like a touristic place where you can have a look and stuff like that but if it's otherwise then please let me know down below because i don't want to be wrong and i just want to let people know the actual facts around here but yeah subscribe to my channel and i will see you soon